Eddie Roy. Today is February 27, 2013. I've been in Oklahoma for about three days now. Managed to just barely escape the motherfucking feds. Whoever those sons of bitches were at the state line. There even is such a thing anymore. Cooper passed another executive order essentially making local PDs an extension of his government militia. Everywhere you turn, it's a son of a bitch with a badge trying to be the next John Wayne. I just want to see my family. It's been four fucking months. Need to catch up with Jake, too. I can't go anywhere near Texas. Way too much housing I eat on me. <laughs> then again, who the fuck am I kidding? Everybody named Mama's looking for me. Hell, I put bullets in John Artis and Robert Williams. Or at least that's what the news is saying. Can't believe they fucking framed me for a double homicide. Crazy part? I'm not even an afterthought in the media. A year ago, this shit would have been the lead story on every news outlet across the country. But now, it's registration updates, protests. We are officially post-LNPA. Everything is different. Switching to surveillance audio feed. Put your hands where I can see them and slowly stand to your feet. Listen, bro. I don't want no problems, man. I'm cool. And you won't have any problems as long as you follow instructions. Now get on your feet. Look, man, I don't know what the problem is, but I got identification in my wallet if you would just... My dude, what the fuck? I'm cool. Base, this is Deputy Rhodes. I got a 1066 I'm bringing in for interrogation. Black male, early 30s. Looks like another low life drifter. Watch that, Rhodes. Go ahead and cuff him, bring him in for processing. 10 4, copy that. Alright, asshole. Turn around and put your hands behind your back. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him or her present with you while you are being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. Do you understand each of these rights I have explained to you? Look, bro, we can work this out, man. It don't, it don't have to be like... Audio corrupted. Moving to next audio entry. You, get your ass up and follow me. Can I ask where I'm going? The only thing you may do is shut your goddamn mouth and do what you're told before you end up like him. All right, man, I got it. Damn. Thank you, Deputy. Now go out there and see to it that our friend doesn't die on us before we get what we want to know. Copy that, sir. I'm going to tell you the same thing I told your new roommate. One way or another, we are going to find out everything we want to. How soon we find out will be entirely up to you. And let me tell you, it is in your best interest to not keep us waiting. Look, I don't know shit about shit. I'm just passing through on my way back to Tulsa. Check my wallet, I have ID. Oh, you mean that poorly forged piece of shit that says you're Anthony Waiters and live in Tulsa? Yeah, try again. Sir, listen. I don't know what the problem is, but I promise you I am legit. My ID is legit, I'm registered and everything. I'll tell you what. How about I let you spend some time with Deputy Rhodes? He is extremely persuasive with your kind. The fuck is that supposed to- Oh, okay, you got a little fire in your boy. Okay, well, Rose can take care of that real quick. <laughs> Deputy Rhodes, you're up. Seems a new friend is adamant that he really is who his ID says he is. Why don't you jog his memory a bit? Copy that, Captain. Listen. I'm not
I'm not in that business of wasting time, so I'll get right to it. The government is on the hunt for any non-registered aliens. At this point, any alien that has not registered under the ordinance of the Lucis Natural Rate Protection Act is considered to be an enemy of the state. Now, here in Newkirk, we've done a damn good job of weeding y'all out and turning you over to Uncle Sam. That is, until recently. Now, we understand that there is a cell of unregistered anti act scumbags that have been helping the alien refugees make their way through the south of Canada. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? Man, hell no. I told you. I'm legal, officer. But listen, bro. I'm saying, though. Can we work something out? I'm not your brother. We have nothing in common other than skin tone and this curse of a condition. Wait. Your alien? Talk about crabs in a fucking barrel. That will be the last time you put your hands on me. Now how about you uncuff me, send me on my way, and forget you ever saw me. Try again, idiot. Enhanced eidetic memory, they call it. Some of my memories are as timeless as a painting, and upon physical contact, I can share that memory with just about anyone. The part that sucks for you, it also makes me completely resistant to any type of suggestion. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, that's not the half of it, bruh. See, I know exactly who you are, Alfred. Oh, wait. You go by Freddy now, right? Saw a newscast back in October. Some disgruntled employee shot and killed the CEO of his company upon learning the company had just been acquired by Halcyon Industrial. Crazy motherfucker even shot and killed the Halcyon CEO. Never showed your face on the broadcast, though. But that TSC logo imprinted on the inside of your wallet triggered my EEM, and well, that's where you fucked up. You know you fucked up, right? Look, I don't know what... Stop. Whatever bullshit was about to come out of your mouth, stop it. Now I ask myself, what happens if I turn you in? The government probably fries your ass, which would be a waste of resources. So Alfred, I'm sorry, Freddy, I'm going to give you a chance. Better yet, a choice. What kind of choice? Every day I see this country hell. The world turning its back on aliens. Pretty soon, they'll hunt us all down. The way I see it, I can give them what they want, and by proving myself useful, I'll see my way through this shit. Hell, I may even get into Congress. <laughs> That's where you come in, Freddy. I need someone like you to be my eyes and ears out there. You feed me a few of your buddies out there, I get promoted. You get to live as a fugitive on the run. So you asking me to sell out my own people? You're going to have to kill me, bruh. No, I'm not. You said in your little ghetto monologue back on 71 that you were trying to get to your family. You willing to die before you see them again? Fuck you, you turncoat, self-hating, sorry son of a bitch. <laughs> now that's the response of a man out of options. Here's how we'll start. Your new cellmate in there is holding on to some valuable information. Some of Newkirk's finds were killed during an LNPA VIP registration attempt. We believe it was an ambush. I refuse to believe all that carnage was the result of a four-year-old boy and his father. Anyway, we need to know where the boy and his father were headed, and you're going to get him to tell us. You ever stop to ask yourself what kind of registration process requires armed law enforcement? That's not a question for me to answer, and I'm not in the business of asking myself pointless questions. And what happens when you get what you want? How do I know you'll let me go? You don't. But you really ain't got much of a choice here. You want to see your family again, right? Why the fuck didn't I just stick to I-35? End of audio entry. Playing next entry in surveillance queue. <laughs> hey, you okay, man? <laughs> you look like you could use a meal and a shower. Hey, fuck you, Rhodes. You got info for me or what? You know the deal. You first. Tell me about the exchange. Mm, three sales. One here in town, the other two just further east. Exchanges happen every other day, supplies, rations, you name it. Next one is sometime tomorrow after sundown. Rations? Cargo. What kind of cargo? The kind that can get you one of those fancy promotions from Massa. Real fucking cute. 
How old are your daughters again? Fuck you, Rhodes. That's more like it. Where's the exchange gonna happen? Here. The first two cells are decoys. Gonna stir shit up at the rally to create a diversion. Third cell will offload the cargo. Wait. You didn't say who was receiving this delivery. That's because this is the destination. The human rights rally? These idiots have to know that ING is gonna shut this shit down immediately. The fuck is you trying to pull here, Freddy? They aren't here to be a part of the rally. They don't just expect the ING to show up. They're counting on it. You telling me this is a coordinated attack? Did you just give me intel on a terrorist attack? I told you about an exchange going down. Now you got something for me? You never cease to amaze, Freddy. Here's your care package. Your source's intel was spot on as it turns out. The man who murdered your wife was indeed found dead in his home. Son of a bitch even left a suicide confessional leading us to straight evidence connecting him to her murder. Talk about a slam dunk case. What about the girls? Find out where they are? Who has them? Still can't access those records. She is near top level security clearance only. Stop fucking with me, Rhodes. You know damn well you can put me in contact with somebody who knows. This shit's been going on for two years, man. I need to see my kids. Even if I can find out where your kids are, you know contact will not happen. Best I can do is get them a message. You just keep up the good work. I'll get you that info. You better. Say so what? I said I appreciate your help, detective. Special investigator. Get it right. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm digging around for your info on your kids. I came across this. Case notes for an investigation into some alien that went AWOL on the GIC not too long ago. This is you as a possible connection. The guy's trail led nowhere. It's like dude became a fucking ghost. Need you to see what you can find out about this asshole's whereabouts. Finding him could put Captain in my immediate future. The guy goes by the alias. Cobalt. What the fuck? End of surveillance record. Thank you for choosing Halcyon Industrial.